If you don't want to know how I make this edit, you can skip it. Ever since I was a kid, I've been a child. If I was you, I would cut up my wrist. I'm so tight all over my body. Oh, she just swallowed on it, I don't mind it. Well, in this video, I'm gonna make this smooth AE like scale transition on CapCut. So if you wanna learn it step by step, make sure you watch till the end. But before that, if you are new here, please subscribe and like this video for more content. Step one, make sure your clip are well synced with beats. Now for smooth scale transition, do what I do. Use keyframes to move your clips whether if you want vertical transition or horizontal and zoom transition. Let's say, I want here a zoom out transition, so I will zoom out it like this. And for the second clip, since it was zoom out in the last clip, so in here we will make zoom in transition. Now add key like this. And zoom it. Now do same thing with all. Now here I rotate it to left side. So for next clip, I have to rotate right side for smooth transition. Like this. Now adding keyframes is done, it looks like this. Now we're gonna add graphs for adding smoothness, also for hiding those empty areas. Use this graph for that.
as you've seen transition are more smoother than before, but black areas are still visible. To hide it, go to background option and blur. It will make the background blurry. If it still doesn't work, we're gonna use some effects for that. Now do what I do. Add oblique blur. Copy it six times. Now here it's a vertical transition, so make rotation of this key 50. If the transition is horizontal, then make the rotation 100. As you see, black areas are gone. Make it more likely good, add black and white overlay, and do what I do.
it's done. Now don't forget to enable this optical flow option. This will make your video to next level smoother. Hope you liked the video. 